Alright, here we go. This is my setup. Got a 26-inch uh, HDTV for my main monitor. It's, I think, a $200 basic sharp HDTV from Best Buy, I think, a couple years ago. There, there's my old, uh, extremely old, like, 80s, 90s desktop mic that I'm currently using due to some microphone issues on my headset over there. It, it, I'm it still works. still works great. Anyway, uh, it's my G510. Uh, the backup, secondary old 16x10 uh, monitor that I had in storage, I went ahead and brought out. It only does 1680x1050, uh, but it's good for... I put it on a low resolution, like um, 800p, for uh, if I'm live streaming or doing whatever. I can just have like text up there, or a chat, or a TeamSpeak, or whatever. Um, here's my new mouse pad. Here, I actually got... Let me... Go ahead and open the blinds, actually, so you can see this stuff better. It's probably really dark. Ooh, much better. This just came the other day, or this, was it two days ago? I think it was, I don't know, it might have been yesterday or the day before. It is a uh, X-Track uh, Ripper mouse pad. I don't know, it's uh, $15 off Newegg. That's what you see right here. That's my G9X, which... I cannot see myself using any other mouse. I think the moment, the day that this dies, I'll just order another one. It's a fantastic mouse um, from Logitech, obviously. That's the uh, Aver Media Live Gamer HD Capture Card Hot Button. I just that I just installed. Which, let's see. No, can't really see it. But and this is a generic. I just had to order a replacement one of these. That arrived just yesterday. This did just arrive yesterday, because uh, the official Microsoft one that came with this controller a while back uh, recently died. So I needed a new one if I wanted to use. I want to use that with you know Dirt and Trackmania and maybe Grand Theft Auto, some games like that. Um, throw that down there. Uh, that's my joystick. <laughs> Not that joystick. That's my Logitech uh, 3D Force Pro or Force 3D Pro, whatever. Logitech joystick, it's old, I never use it. I'm having some issues with it right now, that's why it's down in the corner, because it's being naughty. I'm having some issues with my mouse, it's causing my mouse to freak out, so i got to look that up and figure out how to fix that. And this, <laughs> this is my ratty old mouse pad that's like half an inch, well not half an inch, that's an exaggeration I suppose. Almost half an inch thick. And it's tiny, and it's old, and it's generic, and it's crappy. If you, for comparison, really don't like putting this on my new one, but whatever. That's what I was using. I was using it like that, too. I didn't have it horizontal because the keyboard tray, this is my previous desk right here that I have my TV on right now. This is my previous desk. And that right there was my keyboard tray. And I could barely, barely fit that tiny little mouse pad in that orientation, so that's how much room I had, and my keyboard at the same time. And now I've got all this room. So much better. I'm going to have to throw that, I'm going to just throw that thing away. So, let me show you the rest of my room really quick. That is, right, that's my new desk that I just picked up. It's a uh, list price for like almost $400. It's a used desk from a store downtown, um, and I they had it listed for about 99 bucks. I went ahead and got it for 85. It's in perfect condition though. It's I, I doubt that it's actually legitimately be, been used. It looks black, but it's actually like a dark brown, dark red. Very nice desk. Very pleased with it. So that's my setup right there. I do have two posters that I'm going to put up there. I have a Doctor Who and an Iron Man poster because I'm just cool like that. And then <laughs> there's my old desk, which I've put my TV on and uh, my current posters. Bazinga. Battlefield 3, Walking Dead. My never, my always unmade bed. Always unmade bed. I'll go ahead and power up the computer. Go ahead and close the blinds really quick so you can see that better. 
not quite. There we go. That's better. Go ahead and power this on. It's a nice little cover switch, which I actually really like to cover up the power and reset buttons and such so that you don't accidentally touch them. Because I remember a HP, cheap pre-built HP computer that the family had at one point. And I constantly bumped that power button with my foot. <laughs> it drove me fucking crazy. Anyway. Turn my monitor on. You can see the system boot on the other one, though. See, that's an actual computer monitor. This is just a TV, so it's kind of... Yeah. Works great, though. Oh, let me turn that other... There we go. That one, that LED in the front is, you can turn on and off. The one on the side, you can't. I don't have that set up that way. So let me log in here in a second. Or actually, let me show you this first. This came with my graphics card from NCIX. They gave me a little free little, I mean, you know, these, are, these aren't anything special. But I thought it was kind of cool that they just included this. Um, so I just hang it, I just hang it on the back of there in case I need to use it for something, but there you can see the, the graphics card, that, <laughs> that gaudy blue PCB, I hate that, but it's okay. You can see my RAM, motherboard, all that good stuff, yeah, so, I will be right back. Alright, so, now that I'm logged in. That looks pink on my phone right now. That was weird. That was actually white. I think the color balance is off on this on this phone. I think the phone's color balance or white balance is off. Color balance? What the fuck is wrong with me? White balance is off. Um, I have not calibrated that monitor yet, so that's why that looks so odd in comparison to this one. Plus, that's you know a proper computer monitor. That the text text and everything is going to look a lot sharper on that, whereas shapes and pictures and such, such like that are going to look a lot better on here, but that's my system. I will have a, a screenshot of my desktop and still pictures of this whole setup and everything, and the, the innards of my rig over there, uh, down below in the description, as well as in a link on the main channel page, so that you guys can look at that if you want to. So there you go, guys. That's my system, my rig. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, like it if you did. Please, it really helps me out a lot. Uh, comment if you have any questions. Um, I'd be happy to answer them. I'm gonna, I've been slacking with my messages, I know. I have not been answering or even reading any of them for a while. I've been very lazy this past month. After I got back from that out-of-town job, I just sort of, I don't know, fell behind. Autofocus, there we go. And, uh, yeah. Anyway. I will get to them as soon as I can. Um, I have a vlog maybe planned pretty soon, as well as uh, I'm putting up a Battlefield 3 video Ooh, very soon. I may actually put it up before this. I don't know. You'll know. If, if you're watching this right now, you'll know. If there's no Battlefield 3 video, it'll be coming right after this, or soon after this. Uh, if you're watching this video and you've already seen that Battlefield the video, then there you go. So, <laughs> you are speak you're currently listening to past Pacer, not future Pacer. Future Pacer knows more than I do. He doesn't tell me shit. But, um, anyway. Until next time. Uh, bleh, 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 bleh. Until next time, guys. See ya.